this last broadcast, this is how we're going to go out. Right now, we're going to start the bells. I'm sure that most of you recognize this. It's Merk Top Hosterk, our interval signal that would announce Radio Netherlands' arrival to the short waves. And we'll play the bells to the end. And when they finish, we'll do something a little different. We'll play the Dutch national anthem, the Wilhelmus. And then there will be silence. You won't hear from us again on shortwave. But this isn't the end. Our new task for the few of us who are left behind will be to build something new and ambitious. For 65 years, we have been a broadcaster that has had the tremendous good fortune to be totally editorially independent. We were never a government mouthpiece. This was a rare thing during the heydays of shortwave, and it is today. So, as of Monday, we are being asked to look at the world and to search for places where the media is less than free and lend a hand. And in some cases, we'll be going to them, and where that's not possible, we will help them come to us. It's a worthy task, and I, for one, am happy to do it because, frankly, that's what we were doing anyway. And hundreds of you have written in over the last week. We've read all your comments, and we feel really great about them. So thank you so much for writing. And above all, thank you for listening. Thank you for valuing what we did. Thank you for letting us know it was worthwhile. We are profoundly moved, and we hope that sometimes we moved you too. As Dr. Sue said, don't cry because it's over. Smile, because it happened. And so... On behalf of all of us here, for the last time from Hilversum in Holland, this is Radio Netherlands, the Dutch International Service. Thank you for listening, and goodbye. Goodbye!